the preparation of transplanting pits in the main field, we first need to tie a plastic rope in the bamboo sticks. And using that rope, we make the rules in which the transplanting pits will be made. After doing that, we maintain a spacing of 3 feet, that is 90 cm, between every two rows throughout the field. Take a bamboo stick of 2 feet in length and use that stick as a measuring tool to make the transplanting pits within each row. Here you can see how a transplanting pits are being marked for digging using that bamboo stick. The transplanting pits are digged using a hand hook and should be made into 15 cm deep and 15 cm wide. Nicely prepared transplanting pits within a single row will look something like this. And we repeat the same process in the other rows of the field as well. Care should be taken in maintaining that spacing throughout each row. Now using the already prepared transplanting media, we fill each of the pits with this media. Here you can see how a farmer is filling up the transplanting pits with the media. After filling up each of the transplanting pits, we then mix the transplanting media thoroughly with the topsoil. Make sure we break the clots of the soil and make them into fine pieces. We bring the seedling tree along with the healthy seedlings into the main field for transplanting. We take each of the healthy seedlings from the tree and place them into the, each of the pits at one seedling per pit. After transplanting, we cover up the pit with the original topsoil and tamp it a little so that it remains firm and erect. Care should be taken in keeping the seedlings deeply anchored and make sure that leaves avoid touching the soil surface. This will help in preventing the plant from soil borne diseases. After doing this, a light irrigation should be applied over the transplanted seedlings in each field. 